Hey Crock Posse, Aunt Lou here, and today we are going to be making six can crock pot chicken vegetable soup. All while having a whole lot of fun. What you think? Mm. Posse, Aunt Lou here and welcome back to my outdoor camper kitchen here at Camp Ludacris and today we are going to be making one of the easiest chicken vegetable soups you will ever make in your life. It is six can crock pot chicken vegetable soup. So we got our six cans out here and what started me on a um, canned little route, I don't know, that'd be a path, let's say. Um, earlier this year was we had a reader who said that they were receiving boxes of food and they had canned meats in them and so could I come up with some recipes and so this was one of the first ones I did and we really enjoy it and now that um, it's starting to it's supposed to start to be fall here in Indiana um, the weather isn't wanting to cooperate but our minds are still in that fall kind of mood so fall always means soup right so We've got our can of chicken, can of sliced potatoes, can of peas, can of carrots, or sliced carrots, and then two cans of broth that we're gonna um, take part of it and mix with some flour to kind of help thicken it up a little bit, and then we got some poultry seasoning, and that's it. So I am making a double batch so that I have enough for everybody here at camp. Um, so I've already put the like first batch in my crock pot. So that's why I am using a six quart. If you are making a single batch of this, you will use a four quart. So what you're going to do, you're going to take your drained chicken and put it into your crock pot. And you're gonna take two forks and you're just gonna pull it all apart into bite-sized pieces or whatever size pieces you want. You can shred it if you want. Okay, so we're just gonna do this. I messed up because the first step in the recipe is actually to take a quarter cup of your broth and if you're wondering I've already done this once that's why there's some stuff on this um, measuring cup but a quarter cup of broth and a tablespoon and a half of all-purpose flour and we're going to mix that together and in case you didn't know it, a tablespoon is three teaspoons. So I didn't have a half tablespoon um, measuring spoon available, so I'm just going to use my half teaspoon that I'm going to use later with the poultry seasoning to measure out a teaspoon and a half to give me my half tablespoon. That's your math lesson for the day, and we'll leave it at that because Chris really doesn't like math, um, and so, you know, we don't want her kicking me off here or anything. So we're just going to stir that up. And then set that aside, put our chicken in, shred it up, and then take our drained potatoes, put those in, drained carrots, put those in, drained peas, put those in. Told you, this is super duper simple. And then you got a half a table, or half a teaspoon, excuse me, of poultry seasoning. Sorry for the noise in the background, my puppy's thirsty. Um, and put that in. And then we are going to pour in our broth. And the mixture that we set aside from before, and this is just gonna help Thicken it up a little bit um, as it's cooking. And then I'm just going to give it a little bit of a stir. Nothing, it doesn't have to be perfect. Stir it and we are going to cover and cook on low for four to six hours or high for two to three hours. And we'll be back in three, two, action! Mikey good everyone and we're back and this 
slow cooker cooks very hot so I knew it was gonna be closer to three hours I stirred it once about an hour and a half in and it smells amazing out here now my camper smells amazing so let's spoon up some of this yummy soup there is plenty of broth to go around I forgot a spoon or yeah I'll be back it's been one of those kind of days let's try this again Ooh. oh almost spilled it okay so you oh wow okay the yellow jackets are back oh he he wants a bite of soup oh my there you go guys see what we get to deal with good times so you got your chicken oh oh that oh. I've got a oh okay I'm going to throw this out because now it has a yellow jacket in it and I'm not gonna eat it let's get some more good grief that's how you make it spicy. Um, uh, yeah. Holy cow. Like, he just, he got in there underneath it, and that did not, um, did not go well for him. All right. Let's try this without a yellow jacket in it. So, you can see your seasonings on your chicken and your potatoes and... Oh my goodness, there's another one. Are you kidding? Oh, there's two now. Hey guys, there are peas, carrots, and um, potatoes and chicken and broth in this. I'm going to try to wrap this up before any more yellow jackets are killed in the making of this video or I get stung, okay? Okay, buddy, you need to go away. Uh, okay, I'm just going to turn the bowl so that he's farther away from me. Give this a try. Oh my word. Here comes Mikey. Oh. Just ate the soup already. I got the fly. Oh. I got oh. the I got the bugs. Are you if I get stung, you are in so much trouble. Okay. He's here guys. You wanna try it? No, you get stung. <laughs> Hurry! get stung or get hit I don't know which so. get away from me there's that wonderful savory there's that wonderful savory um, flavor of the poultry seasoning and you have your veggies your meat you have it all in one it is hot, like 80 some degrees here today. And you know what? The soup still tastes amazing. So hot, cold. It's so good. The Yellow Jackets want some. Yes, they do. They they want it so badly, they will die for it. While you're talking about it. He, he's gonna go eat. Do, do I need to wait for you? Or can well, you I? Well, you were telling me it was hot. <laughs> what you think? Mm. I like them taters. I know, aren't they yummy? Mm -hmm. Super simple, super yummy. Give it a try. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up down below. If you haven't become a member of our Crock Posse yet, hit the subscribe button. If you'd like to know every single time we post a video, hit the bell called the ding a -ling. ding And no matter what you do, laugh often. Eat good food! And speak like. Bye. Bye. If you want to see the latest, click on the left right here. If you feel like subscribing, click on the right, my dear. And if you think we're funny, enough to send us money, click the Patreon.